Soldiers fired guns into the air to disperse protesters in Ivory Coast's second city on Friday as the Defence Minister arrived for talks with leaders of a military mutiny that paralysed much of the country last week. The chaotic scenes forced organisers to move the venue of the negotiations, delaying efforts to resolve a bitter dispute over soldiers' peer and conditions that has festered for years. At least 100 soldiers who took part in last week's unrest poured out of their barracks in Boake in pickups and trucks, confronting residents who had gathered to protest against the mutineers. As locals ran to safety, Defence Minister Alan Richard Donhue arrived by helicopter with other senior government and military officials at around 1 p.m. local time. The mutiny which first erupted in Boake subsided last week when the government said it will accept many of the soldiers' demands. <laughs> but negotiators for the mutineers say they had to receive the bonuses agreed to the government last week. They had expected payments to begin on Monday.